Okay guys, we're gonna get food from three different places and I'm gonna try them all and I'm gonna rank them from one to three. Which one's the best? Let's go get these burgers. Oh my word, those burgers smell so good. We're about to go get the third one. Here we go guys, so I'm so excited to try these burgers out. So we got Joy Love Burgers. Truck Wagon and Hat Creek. Then we got and we're gonna I'm going to this one. We're going to flip it over. I'm going to flip it over. That doesn't look great. It's amazing. Look at Joy Love's burgers. It's huge! I think he won the size competition. That's... Yeah. Yeah, I think that won the size competition. First, we're going to try the Hat Creek Burger. The double meat was so good. It blended with the cheese. I tasted the bacon a little bit. And then, I'm pretty sure this thing had that. Yeah, it has the hot sauce in it. Right there. That's the hot sauce. You have to have it with the burger because that's their special sauce. Sexy like filet, this thing. And, and we also have some bacon. Bacon right there. So we're gonna try the fry. Let's get a good one. Mm. Okay. Mm. There was some seasoning in that. You can taste the seasoning. You kind of don't taste the fry though. I didn't taste the fry at all. It's like it was drenched in seasoning. I don't like the seasoning. I like the seasoning, but I like a little bit. I like every. I like the everything taste. You guys probably know what I mean. Now we're gonna move on to the truck wagon. Here we go. I'm gonna get this. Okay, that's good. I didn't taste the bacon. Let me get a piece of bacon. Okay. You can taste the cheese, but the soy the soy bun is so good. Whatever. And I you can it's not yet melted. I like my cheese a little bit melted, but you can barely taste the bacon in this. I didn't taste the bacon in the front at all. I think it was moved somewhere towards the back. I like to dig in into the corner piece of it better than the back of it first. Now we're gonna try. The fries are good. I can taste the fry and the seasoning mixed together in one. Mm, you can taste them. You can taste a little bit of seasoning right there. There's a pinch of seasoning. And then you can taste the fry. I like that. I really do like that. It's one of my fa favorite things about fries. This is the biggest burger I've ever seen. One of the biggest. Let's try this.
Mm. Mm. That is good. You can taste the bacon because the bacon's on the beak. I like that. You can also taste the pickle. I love pickles for one. And then you can also taste the cheese. The bread? Mm. It doesn't taste like the um, sourdough bun and chuck wagon, but I still kind of like it. And then you can taste the meat. The meaty part. Look at it. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Mm. And now we're gonna move on to the fries. Let's see, let's find a good fry. Ooh, this one. This one looks strong. Here we go. We got a fry. That was barely any seasoning. There was no seasoning in that fry, just fry. This, I mean, the fries kind of disappointed me because I really, the fries didn't have that much season. They didn't have any seasoning in it. All I could taste was the fry. So, taste this for the fries. It's like one of the worst fries. This, the Hat Creek has second place for the fries, tasting this, and this one has third place, I mean first place. Chuck Wagon has the best fries because you can taste the seasoning and the fries at the exact same time. They're not like mixed together like Hat Creek and they're not just fries like Joy Love Burgers. And then Mom, drum roll please! The tastiest burger is Chuck Wagon. So no, please. For the biggest size burger is Joy Love Burgers. And for the juiciest burger is. Because they had the sauce in it. My favorite combo, fries and burger, is Chuck Wagon! Ta da! In this video, we were able to help three local restaurants. It's time to do your part. If you like my video, please like. Share, subscribe. Thank you for watching.